Dude, get down! Dude, I'm a press, I'm pressed. Where's your press sign? Dude, I'm... That's not good for the old transmission. Yeah, these people don't even look like they were involved with it and they got their car towed. What was your name? I didn't give it. Huh? I didn't give it. You don't want to give it? I guess. Oh! The wind keeps switching directions. Damn! So these plastic dumpsters just kind of melt to nothing. Oh, it reeks. Oh, I got a face full of plastic. <laughs> oh, that reeks. I can't be by that. It's not good to breathe. He doesn't want me to move. But. So I just got tackled to the ground. I have a clear identifier on my hat. There's no reason for tackling me on the ground, so I gotta scrape. You understand why we talk to you, right? Yeah, can I get up now? Like, he tackled me to the ground. Like, I, it was a little. I told you to get on the ground. Get down! Dude, I'm a press! I'm pressed! Where's your press sign? Dude, I'm the press! Get down! Dude, I'm a press. I'm press. Where's your press sign? Dude, I, I, I will completely comply. Like you just gotta talk to me. Like you. You're gonna get met with the same. I, I just want to film like the arrest, man. You want to go? No, I don't want to be arrested. I want to film the arrest. Get up and get out of here. Okay. You want to get up? I'm, I'm, I'm good, man. Okay. See ya. Oh, I actually. I'm that way. Okay. okay. Yep. Go out of here. Are you guys bringing in the fire department for for these fires, yep. though? You gotta get out of here, though, bro. Yep. I'm telling you. Yep. Okay. Here's your warning.
So you have to leave. I'm and you're the one you. to tackled me then? I didn't tackle you. I told you to get on the ground. Okay. Okay. All right. Then can I get your badge number? Yep. Zero one zero seven. All right. Thank you. What was your name? I didn't give it. Huh? I didn't give it. You don't want to give it? I'm a press, dude. What, what's your name? You asked mine. You have my cords there. What's your name? What's your name? Do you want me to leave or what? Yeah, I want you to leave. Okay. Go this way. I'm going, man. If you come back, you'll go to jail. <laughs> Where are you pressing? You have a hat that says press? Where else are you? Where's your press badge? Who oh, is press badges? Everybody. All right. Uh on the topic of press passage, here let's let's uh, look up the Wikipedia.org article since apparently that's this is a, a, quite some difficulty for for a lot of uh, for a lot of police officers to even come to this realization. Uh, let's see. I guess I should read it out loud for them because I don't know if all of them can even read. Uh, so so there I was on a public sidewalk recording in public on a sidewalk. And, and I have a lot of extra protections that, that way. You don't need a press pass to record on a sidewalk. Uh, so you do, sometimes you will get extra advantages to being, uh, you know, noticed of being a, a press pass holder or whatever. But like I was on a sidewalk in a public area. Uh, I didn't need access to a crime scene and didn't want to cross police lines. I was merely you know, filming in public. They wanted me to move behind their lines. I complied. Like, they did, there was no reason for them to push me over. Um, yeah, so, so you know who issues press passes? Here, let's let's look up the Constitution and look up that First Amendment, right? Somebody issues press pass. You can't just wear a... The company that, that you work for issues it, right? Who's your company? That's your last warning, okay? You're getting a freebie. I'm getting a freebie? Oh, I appreciate it. Oh, it's my freebie, I guess. What a dick. We're going to look that guy up. All right, so I'm pretty sure this is the officer that uh, attacked me and pushed me down to the ground and then claimed that he didn't tackle me, even though I have video evidence. And he should have video evidence on his body camera that we're going to have to request. Uh, so this is the Communities Against Police Brutality.org website. Uh, Jason Anderson. Uh, his name was Anderson. I did confirm that on his on his chest there, and he told me his badge number was zero one zero seven. So that's a little different. So I'm not sure about that, but I'm pretty sure this is the guy that looks like him. Uh, so yeah, he's he's been uh, he's been involved in a lot of stuff here. Apparently, he was he he shot and killed this Fong Lee. Um, they were pretty angered by the verdict here. Here, let's open these up. I already have some of them open, but. Yeah, and, and meanwhile, I'm doing this while I'm dual wielding cameras. So it's obvious that I have two different cameras in my hands and this guy comes up and tackles me. I'm just, I can't believe this is still a law enforcement officer and he's gotten his job back multiple times. Uh, this is just one article on him from MP, NPR News. Uh, so here's another article on him. Fired Minnesota officer to have a proven career saver arbitration. So apparently he got his job back after he was fired. Um, you know, I, it's just, it's just amazing to me here. Let's look, look for him. Fired in 2010 after allegedly kicking a teen in the head after being untruthful about it during an investigation. Arbitrator ordered him to be reinstated after concluding that Anderson, who told investigators he could not recall the details, but knew he did not kick the teen in the head of phrase, could not be expected to remember an event from earlier, a year earlier without seeing his report on it, which he was not allowed to see. He was not fired for shooting and killing Fong Lee, a team who was running from the police in 2006. And he was cleared of wrongdoing in the death lawsuit after a federal jury found that he used reasonable force. So he has actually killed somebody. Uh, that's interesting, looking a murderer in the eye. Uh, what else is there?
Yeah, there's just a bunch of bunch of. This guy's a piece of work. Like I'm surprised that he still has. He's still employed. What else is on him here? Yeah, he won't take a drug test, I guess. Oh, that's the union objective. Oh, yeah, so he's got union protections, right? This, this guy's got a lot of history on him. He's been, he's been in the police force for... Oh, yeah. I, I, did, I just said that. But here, look at the article. I think they just have issues with Jason, he said, with the police administrator. Every time he gets one st step closer to being back to work, they throw up something to prevent that from happening. Huh. So they have problems with Jason, but I, I think the problems are Jason. So I, I have video showing him pushing me down. Uh, I can tell he's a violent person. I was standing still with two cameras in my hand. Mind you, I was live streaming in my right hand, and then I had my static recording in the left hand. And the static recording is where you see him charging me and pushing me down. And then you can actually see, uh, this is where uh, the police spotlights come in handy for me, because you can see the shadows of him pushing me on the ground. Dude, I'm oppressed! I'm pressed! Where's your press sign? Dude, I'm... Oh yeah, he's he's definitely getting a complaint. I have no doubt about that. There's no reason for him to tackle me. Well, I got them tackling me on two cameras, so we got that going for us while live streaming. So those fires are getting bigger down there. Scuffed my elbow up too. Fucking prick. Oh, oh yeah. Here's my fresh knee injury that he didn't tackle me doing. Oh, I got his, uh, I got his badge number. Those fires are still blazing. Don't worry, I got that running as well, so pretty sure that guy messed up pretty bad there. And no, for documentation purposes, this is what my hat looks like. So when you look at me, you can see a clear identifier right facing them. This fire is still blazing though. Yeah, these, these cops don't know about the Constitution, I guess. Anyone can wear a hat with press, but do they? Sure, do you wear one? Looks like they're bringing tow trucks in. They're coming in quick. They're gonna get whatever cars are in the intersection, it looks like. It's 
So the tow trucks came before the fire trucks, apparently. I don't know how that makes any sense. They're, let, they're letting the street burn there. Who issues credential, Alan Loveless? Who issues credentials? Why don't you read the law? Fire is still going. I think that's important to document, but. team of tow trucks came before we could get any kind of fire trucks in so we could stage stage tow trucks we could stage tow trucks but we couldn't stage fire trucks follow up with that I have no doubt some cops just want to hurt people and that was one of them still tow trucks flying in but no fire department get around the other side and look at it from a different intersection. If anybody can uh, look up that guy's badge number for me and put his name in here, that'd be great. Their, uh, their complaints are open records online too. I've already looked at Minneapolis before. I think, I think we've only ever put one in on a sergeant before, but. Yeah, they're just letting that fire burn out. It looks like. They're able to pull all these 
buses in for bodies and all these tow trucks in, but no fire trucks are allowed in. Why? Good for the old transmission. Looks like the police kind of just drove through the fire there. I don't know if you guys can see that all the way down there. This might be fire trucks coming in, finally. Yeah, I think that's about it then. I can put that fire out. It's almost already out. It does look like there's still one tow truck in the way there. Fire trucks are kind of waiting patiently. Shoppers hovering there. Let me let me do you a favor and get your uh, your truck number on that guy, huh? It says Bobby and Steve's.
Yeah, man. I'm a coward. For sure. No doubt about it. Kind of curious what these people are saying. Looks like they're talking peaceably to these guys over here. Yeah, these people don't even look like they were involved with it and they got their car towed. This is 31st and Hennepin that I ended up at here. Whew, I love those spotlights. Those are bright. Those are different than the those are different than the trooper lights. Those are different than the uh, St. Paul lights. I usually get those shined in my face. <laughs> 